Hey, it's Joanne. I'm back again. Um, and I am coming this time to finish Angel C. I already did the second part. And this time I'm going to finish her up because I need to move on and I wanted to get it done today. So I worked on some botanicals, trying to paint some leaves earlier. And now I'm back again, trying to uh, finish her up finally. We're going to add some eyes to this dove and a beak. And we're going to add her eyelash, her eyebrows, okay? Her eyebrows. And we're going to do this bottom portion in white again. Give it a second coat of white. And then we're going to add some gold and some silver. I wasn't sure if I should use this flat brush. And... While it's sharp to go in these corners, I still need a different kind of brush because um, this one isn't really helping me out the way that I want it to. So let's just get another one, okay? All right, because that brush is a little hard. This one is more flexible, okay? So we add this second coat of white in. And what I decided was, instead, earlier, I thought about, like, is it going to be too much to make these roses um, gold with these gold stars? And I think it will be. So, what I decided I'm going to do then is just go ahead and make the roses um, gold and then make the stars silver. That's what I'm going to do. Okay. And then I think I'll like it like that. Because I guess in some idea I can keep them this red color that they are. But I don't want to. So, you know, I don't want to. And she'll just probably end up in my Christmas collection of porcelains that I put out. I might even leave her out anyway and put her on display for this Christmas season. So we just go ahead and add a second coat of this white. And then we'll go on to the details of these other things. All right. Yes. Oh, y'all can't even see. I'm so sorry. It's like you can't even see. I can't see. I can't see. I apologize. I'm painting away. I'm just back here and y'all just looking at her wings. I'm sorry. Let me move these um, paints out of the way. Because what happened was I put the camera down really really close to the desk so that y'all could see up close and in doing that I did not realize that you know I'm still working back toward the edge of the desk where I'm usually working when the camera is up high but in this particular situation I need to extend my arm so that you all can see I apologize for that. Okay. And this is not the best paint job on this cloud stuff, but it's okay. I think this will be fine. It's just clouds. They don't have to be smooth and all of that. I mean, I would wanted it to be, but I'm not sweating it. What I'm trying to do is just clean it up. That's it. Just clean it up and make it nice. So that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing here. 
okay. And we're just about finished with the second coat of white. All right. And then we can move on in a few more minutes. And so, wonder if any of you have seen me trying to paint those flower petals. Like, that is the hardest thing for me. I even bought the doodle book. I showed that and everything. It's like, I just don't get it. You know? I want to be an artist. I want to be. I can't even see this star almost. It's just like completely gone almost. But I'm going to work it out some kind of way. Some kind of way I'm going to work it out. You watch and see. Okay. Now, that's about that. All right. And I think that's about as clean as it's going to get. You know, maybe... Maybe it's a little bit more white here. I got my Christmas book set in here because I've not looked through it yet. I wanted to. I wanted to look through that and I've not done it yet. And I have three of them. I have three of them. Okay, so now that's going to be that for that cloud. Let me see. This is up in there. I need to come across here a little bit. Because it's like on the bottom of her dress a little bit. And I might fix that later off camera with some silver. Okay. So, I'm going to say I'm finished with that white. That's what I'm going to say about that. Um, okay. Now, for these flowers, these roses... I'm going to get this small little brush, this teeny, teeny one, okay, and we're going to get gold, all right, and I'm going to work with it straight out of the cap, I'm not going to put none on the plate, because I already, um, I already know it's going to be enough in this to just do this little bit of detail because it won't take very much. Just come in here. Well, maybe I'm wrong. Okay. All right. Let's put that up in there like that. And then let's come and get why is this so wet? It's so liquidy. I'm not sure what's happening here. This folk art on oh, this deco art. I don't know why it's this wet. Maybe I didn't shake it good enough. All right, let's see. I did shake it up before I started the video, but maybe I didn't shake it good, good, good. All right, let's try and get some of this down in here. And it's wet. I don't want to put too much because I don't want it to run on the white. So as long as I can get it on there a little bit and drag it around, then I will give it a second coat afterwards off, off camera because... It's going to have to dry or either it'll just, you know, be just runny and I don't want it to do that. That then will be making double work. Okay. And you see how runny it is already. And I dried my brush because I knew. All right, so that looks better to me, even though it's not um, 
a second coat on there yet. I like that better. I don't know how I'm going to like the silver stars too much yet. At first, I was going to make these roses purple at first. But I was like, no, nah, that's okay. Like a lavender purple. I said, no, nah, let's not. Let's just make it gold. Now, that actually, the gold star right beside it actually might not be bad. It might, you know, I can see that right there. You see it? It doesn't really look too bad. I'm not, okay, let's see. Maybe we'll do some silver and some gold. Let's try this one right here. This is a big one. All right, let's try this. We got to try and get the points in. All right. All right. I know somebody might be like, what is always thumping and making that noise? Maybe y'all can't hear it very well. But these two little cats that I got up in here, they be running across the floor, up and down the hallway. They be doing the most, honey. Okay. So that one, oh, I see. It's got some, ran right off on the white. Okay. It ran right off on the white. This is piled up in the middle. I don't want it to run off. All right. Okay, so now let's try this one around here. This one is pretty messed up oh too much paint too much got that on the white too all right It's actually not that much on the white, but I can tell it's on there a little bit. Okay. I probably should have used that other gold that I have because this is more like yellow gold. I got a gold that looks bronzy like that. Wonder should I make that? I'm going to just keep them all gold. I'm going to just keep them all gold. I was going to make this one silver. Might have been pretty too. Never know. Just keep it all gold. It's not too bad with the gold roses. I don't think. I think it's all right. I think it's all right. All right, let's see. This is runny, I think. Let me see. Oh, that's from earlier today. So I gotta fix that in there. Oh, I went off. This is too thin. The paint is too thin for this. You can't really. Get it the way you want it. All right. Okay, now. Okay. All right. It's thin, but we'll just work with what we have.
I might go over this with that other gold because that this gold is, I mean, it's bright and pretty, but it's, it's I don't know, it's runny or something. It's not really acting the way I want it to be. But it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. I see a little bit of gray on there back here. All right, a little bit right there. Okay, don't do too much because I don't want it to run onto the white. It's already in a way, if I can say that. Okay. This is all right. I think that's okay like that. All right. And let me see. Um Now we just got to clean them up a little bit. And that's that. That's not too bad. That's not too bad, I don't think. I got to wait until it dries some more. Because it's too runny to do anything else with. Alright, so. Okay, now we got that. Now, for that. It's done. I have this. My sewing needle is still threaded. I'm not going to take the thread off. I'm just going to use the tip of it to give her some new eyebrows. That's what I'm going to do with this because I don't have the skill of using the tip of the brush and it might be very 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 what you call um very thick so i'm just getting the tip i got on that gold paint golly um i'm just gonna try to give her a very thin eyebrow right about here Well, it's not on the tip good. Let's see. It's on there, but it's not enough on the tip. I can feel the pen scraping, but it's not enough paint, and that's why I didn't want to use a brush. I'm going to have to try to brush them because I feel the pen um, scraping, but it's not actually um getting where we need to get so we have to try the tip of a brush and i don't know whether to wet it or not but i am i'm gonna wet it this one has still got the glue on it maybe that's a good thing you know they come all pointy like this and there's glue on them to keep all of the bristles together so maybe that's good i've not used this one yet so maybe that'll help me out i don't have a very steady hand when it comes to trying to get that done but i have to give it a try i'm gonna have to give it a try here it goes let's see i'm sure it'll be too thick maybe Cause it looks like it's too much on there now. Wipe some off. Let's see. Too thick. Too thick. All right, but we're gonna go on this side and try to make them even at least, and not too messy. Let's see. 
Oh, y'all can't see. Now you can see. Let's see. That one is a little thinner. That's a little thinner. I can't have it a little thinner. I should have not painted her face. That's what I should have done. Not painted her face, honey. Because why does she have black eyebrows? But she had black eyebrows from the beginning. All right, I'm going to wash this little tip off. And it looks like I can use a little bit of blue in her eye. Because I can see paint in her eye. Let me see if I can fix that little bit. This is too blue. This is probably too blue. Yeah, this might be too blue. Let's see. All right, let's try this one. This one might be okay. Oh, don't think I can open this top, but let's just get a little piece of it. Oh, that's too much, but we only need a little bit. Let's put this top on here because we don't need no more of this black until we get to that little bird. Wet the tip of this, put it in here just a little bit and try to get in the corner of her eye. Okay, we got it. Oh, I'm looking at it up close. Her eyes are blue. So, I'm trying to... This is not good. <laughs> this is not good because I'm not an artist and I don't know how to really fix it like this. But I wanted to change her face color. And now I'm at a place where you shouldn't have changed her face color because now her eyes are too blue. I mean, I don't really know. I can't really fix it. Let's get her some little bit of some kind of peachy lipstick or something. I don't know. I don't know. These are the problems that you have when you're trying to be an artist and you know that you're not an artist. You know that you're not an artist. I don't want pink. I want some type of peachy like her. Like her mouth already looks. Like it has like a little... Y'all, I'm just saying that's okay, though. It's okay. Let's just try to get a little bit of pink. Just a little touch of pink to mix with this little bit of yellow. Orange yellow. That's what it is. Orange yellow. And put a little pink with it. And come up with some lipstick because she need a little bit okay just a little bit all right okay we're trying it you see her lips you see them she has that face paint that i put on her complexion and she needs a little bit of lipstick outline on her lips and that's not bad. I did that pretty good. Let's just get in the crack a little bit. And in this crack a little bit. And the bottom. And that's good enough. So that turned out okay. But her eye is a little bit too blue. Maybe if we put just a wee, wee, wee dot in her eyeball in the center of it it will 
tone it down for us a wee bit. Let's get a little bit a tip of the black and put it in the middle. Right there. I don't know if it's getting there. Um, there it is. It's there now. And right there. Okay. Now she looks better. She looks better now. Yes, she looks better. And when the black dries, I'll give it a little teeny bit of white in the middle. That's better. That's so much better, even though she shouldn't have black eyebrows. Meanwhile, they were black before I changed them. The bird needs a little eye here. And can you see it? It's there. And then we're going to give them another one. Over here, it's a little indentation right there. And we're all done with the bird. He's got his eyes again. And now we're gonna use the same lipstick color. And a little teeny bit, well, we'll need to use that. I got this dark orange color over here that I brought. It's not even open. So we'll just use this one. Why is it not going down? I'm sorry, y'all. I don't know why it's all the way up the top like this. It's just crazy. All right, we're just going to get the tip of it out of the cap. All right, and then we're going to put it on his beak. Okay. I gotta turn it sideways so I can see where the beak is. All right. Oh. And then we'll put it on the side. And then we'll just get right here a little bit. And that should about cover it. And that's it. Now, y'all see it. That's it for that. And I just need to go over the stars again when they dry because it's too wet. And that's all I needed to do. I am put a little white dye in her eye in the center of that black or off the center some kind of way. And that's that. This one is done. Done, done, done. And I'm kind of happy with it. I just have to fix this gold some kind of way when it dries. And so there you have it. This is what she turned out like. Okay. Our little dove is doing well. And she's all finished. It's not too bad. She's got a little white paint beside her foot. But I'm not going to worry about that. Even though I have some more of that beige. Um, that tone that I made of mixed color. But I have to wait for the white to dry. Or else it will run all together. And we'll finish up the stars off camera. And she is finished. So... Maybe you'll like, comment, and subscribe. Nobody has said anything from the first one or the second one, but maybe by now someone will have a comment or a like. And thank you for watching. And I will now end this video. And I will see you in my next video. Maybe I'll do another one after I look through my Christmas book. Because I have three of them and it's going to take a long time to look at them and absorb and understand what it is. So, I'll see you the next time.